آؤز باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ اسٹوڈنٹس ٹو آل آف یو دس ٹاپک از فار دا کلاس تھرڈ اینڈ دا نیم آف دا ٹاپک دیٹ وی آر ریڈنگ از لیونگ اینڈ نان لیونگ تھنگس اسٹوڈنٹس ان دا لاسٹ ٹاپک وی سا واٹ آر لیونگ اینڈ واٹ آر نان لیونگ تھنگس اینڈ وی ڈسکس سم Uh, features of living and non living things today we will read one more feature about living things and non living things students we can differentiate between living and non living things by the thing that living things show movements students plants are also included in living things and living things show movement students how plants show movement as we know that plants do not move from one place to another place they do not move in search of food but what do they do they make their food by their own by the process that's called as photosynthesis students that process by which plants make their own food that is called as photosynthesis students for example a lotus a lotus flower opens out at sunrise and closes at night there is one more plant that is called as mimosa pudica mimosa pudica is a, a plant is a name of plant and it's commonly called as touch me not flower students when this mimosa pudica is touched its petals get curled out and they close so when mimosa pudica is touched it closes so this is a kind of movement which mimosa pudica shows another feature of living things is that living things grow students for example human beings are born small for example we are born small but what but with time what happens they grow bigger and bigger for example students a baby boy grows bigger and bigger and uh, finally he becomes a man and similarly a baby girl is born smaller and uh, with time she grows and grows and she becomes a woman so students today we read two more features of living and non living things that students plants uh, that are living things or living things show movements non living things do not show movements and living things grow non living things do not grow now students a homework for you that you have to find the answer of the question what is a living and a non living thing in three lines you will uh, give the answer of the question what is a living and a non living thing thank you